Hey there guys, it's Robert from RobGeo 0407L and welcome to episode 335 of Lego Mystery. Today we're going to have a look at the Cincinnati Reds and the Philadelphia Phillies. Let's start with the Cincinnati Reds. Let's take a look at the short by if you don't know what the Cincinnati Reds are. They are an American professional baseball team that plays for the MLB. It was established in 1881. Their ballpark is the Great American Ballpark. They have won five World Series titles, nine NL pennants, one AA pennant, three NL Central Division titles, seven NL West Division titles, and one Wild Card Burst. <clears throat> Their owner is Bob Castellini. Their manager is David Bell. Their general manager is Nick Kroll. And their president of baseball operations is Dick Williams. Now, without further ado, let's get started. 1890 to 1899, we just have uh, a red. We have an, the old English C in red. That's all there is. 1900, it's changed to just a regular C in red. 1901 to 1904, the C changes. 1905, the C changed into a C with a white triangle. 1906 to 1907, the C is different. 1908 to 1912, it changes again. 1913, the white triangle has been removed, and we have the word reds. 1914, uh, um, the C got en elongated or enlarged, and the reds and the word reds became smaller. 1915 to 1919, um. Well, 1950 to 1919, uh, it's different. 1920 to 1935, the C has black outline. 1936, we have a blue C now with the word reds and blue, and it's inside a well, a red, a red oval. 1937 and 1938, it goes back to the previous one. Well, not the previous, but the 1920 to 1935 one. Was only and they only reused it for about two seasons. 1939 to 1953, uh, we have uh, a red C in in red with white outline, and then we have the word reds in in red with uh, white outline, and it's surrounded by a blue shape. 1954 to 1960, we just have a baseball player with the head of a baseball with a mustache. Nothing special or anything. 1961 to 1966, same here, same as the 1939 one, but the shape that's surrounding the Red Sea and the word reds is now black and not blue like the 1939 one. 1967 to 1971, the sea is white, the word reds is white, and the shape that's surrounding it is red. 1930, not 1932, but 1972 to 1992. Uh, we have the Red Sea, and then inside the sea, we have the words Cincinnati Reds in white text. And here we have this baseball player, once again, having the shape of a baseball as a head. 1993 to 1998, uh, we have a white sea, and, and here we have the shape surrounding it, and we have the word Reds. And 1999 to the present, we have the white sea. With the, with the word reds in it, well, probably the same thing as the last one, but the C and the word reds both have drop shadow. And now we will move on to the Philadelphia Phillies. Let's take a look at the short by those of you who don't know what the Philadelphia Phillies are. They are an American professional baseball team that plays for the MLB. It was established in 1883 as the Philadelphia Quakers. In 1889, they changed their name to the Philadelphia Phillies. Their ballpark is the Citizens Bank Park. They have won two World Series titles, seven NL pennants, and 11 East Division titles. It is owned by Phillies Limited Partnership, which consists of John S. Middleton, Jim Buck, Pete Buck, Jim Salisbury, David Montgomery, and Pat Gillick. Their manager is Gabe Kattler. Their general manager is Mac Clintac. And their president of baseball operations is Andy McPhail. Now, without further ado, let's get started. P.S. McPhail's not a fail. 
1900 to 1937, uh, we have a Quaker because, as you can see, it started as the Philadelphia Quakers. Um, <clears throat> so on, on the red rim, we have the words Philadelphia National League Baseball Club. And it's basically in golden text. <clears throat> Excuse me. Um, 1938, uh, the picture in the center of that thing is a little different now. And the rim is now blue, but the text stayed gold. Excuse me. I'm not farting, I'm burping. Excuse me. 1939 to 1943, we have the same picture probably as the 1901. Um... And the golden text for the Philadelphia National League Baseball Club, like it was, like it what was, became like the original gold color now, and not the light gold. 1944 to 1945, uh, we have a, a bird, a blue bird, probably a blue jay, and here we have the word Phillies in red signature, and the dot on the eyes are are red stars. 1946 to 1949, uh, we have um, a white person and another white person. Well, you know what? Let's just say white baseball players. Baseball players who are white. And here we have the words fighting Phillies in, in white text. And here we have this white baseball bat. And it's inside this red background that's shown here. 1950 to 1969, uh, we have um, a red cap with the letter P in it. And here uh, we have this orbit, kind of. And here we have the word Phillies. Also, the orbit features a baseball, because it's a baseball team. 1970 to 1983, we have two Quakers. Two baseball players who are, uh, you know, kind of like Quakers, probably. And here we have the word Phillies in red text. 1984 to 1991. Uh, we have the word Philadelphia in blue text, and we have this baseball, and here we have the word Phillies in red text. Also, we have this clock tower or whatever the heck that thing is, and it's it has the it has the bushes or trees bushes let's just say bushes being behind it. 1992 to 2018, we have. A, oh, sorry, a white bell, and here we have the word Phillies in red text. Um, and it's inside this uh, blue thing that's shaped like a, like a baseball diamond, and it's surrounded by two layers of outline, one red, one white. And this is, well, not, well, yeah, this is another version in which the word Phillies is surrounded by uh, a baseball that, that has the trail of, of what a comma has. And this is uh, another version where, well, this is just the icon version where we just have the letter P in white inside this red background here. And finally, 2019 to the present, uh, um, the, um, um, at, at the, from this season on, they're going to use this logo now. And here uh, we have this blue bell now, the blue well, the white belt changed to, well, well, in the previous logo, it, it was white, and now it changed to blue now. Well, for the season. And here, we have the word Phillies. And the dot on the eyes are, once again, stars. And the stars remind, reminded me of the uh, Dallas Cowboys for a second right there. Um, public service announcement, uh, I just want to let you all know that I am no longer accepting requests. This may seem like bad news, but there's actually a good reason why I'm not accepting any more requests. The reason why is because, um, sometimes requested logos, well, you know what, I love requested logos, but sometimes it can be annoying to, just to see com comments like, Oh, do this logo over and over and over and over again. And then we have people who threat who threaten me to do a logo, otherwise they'll A, dislike all my videos, or B, never watch it again. That to me is very disrespectful. And I'm serious now. You can't just threaten me to um just to have your request. Um Um yeah, um, wait, hmm, 
you know what? You know what? I'm not doing requests anymore because because we have people who threatened me to do a logo, and then we have people who who request it over and over and over again, and it's kind of annoying. Also, it kind of pressures me sometimes because you never know. You never know. I may I might not do it. I mean, there's. Um, but there, but the only time that I will be accepting requests is on special occasions or whenever I feel like I should do it. Don't hate me for this. Don't unsubscribe. Don't dislike the video for me saying this. It's, um, I love requested logos, but sometimes it can be very annoying, very frustrating, and very pressuring for me. And you know what my mom says? I'm, I'm gonna do what, what makes me happy for not only myself, but for, for but for you guys as well. So I just wanted to point that out. So yeah. Alright, that's it for now guys. Thank you so much for watching this episode of Logo History and I'll see you tomorrow for a brand new episode. Stay tuned for episode 336, Seattle Mariners and the Minnesota Twins. But boy!